So we're down to the last eight. The competition you sense rapidly heading towards its big climax. A dash for the finishing line, the showpiece final. Welcome to our live coverage on quarter-final day. It is good to have you with us. And you can see that the atmosphere is building very nicely. Super noise, grand level of expectation, and that is only rising as we head towards kickoff time. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. There is a, a perceptibly greater sense of urgency from both sides here with uh, a place in the last four on the line. Well, look, when you reach this stage of the competition, you begin to think you can go the distance. Now, the big characters in either dressing room will be stressing the need to find whatever it takes to get through. Has everyone got the substance and character to make it happen? These are the questions that both of these sides have to answer today and one side will obviously do it that bit better. So off we go then. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Sadio Mane. He's one of the paciest players around, Peter. He's a, a very dangerous dribbler and a fine finisher to boot. I particularly like the way he gives defenders a headache by drifting across the forward line looking for gaps to to probe and and spaces to get into i think he's going to be a really huge asset for this team yeah hard to see past him he'll be looking to put on a show i'm certain of that and it's tarat sayek yang well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Kiate clips one through. Oh, decisive action by the goalkeeper. He knew he had to get that done. Yang plays it out to the wing. Lovely bit of skill there. Keita can't get the better of his opposite number. That's gone a long way up and away. There to make a great save. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. Koulibaly. And here's Keita. Tarapt drives it forward. And here's Keita. Oh, that's lovely. Senegal have themselves a corner, I think. Yes, they do. Oh, well played, he saw that coming. And here's Keita. And here's Keita. Keita crosses massively! Yes, it's in! Oh, an absolute gem of a cross. It made the header simple. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Senegal have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? And it's played forward. Referee's given a throw. Mane. El Ahmadi. Hoists it forward.
El Ahmadi tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Dira. That is terrific skill. Promising cross. Now it's Keita. Kuyate. Ndiaye. Morocco are already chasing the game. Long time to go. Well, it can be very hard to regroup and work your way back into the match. But they've got time. That's a throw. And it's Gay. Cater crosses. There's been quite a few crosses coming in from that left-hand side. Cater really is providing a, a very good outlet there, and his contributions, I think, are going to be key. Well, the defence have two choices. Deal with the man or, or deal with the space. Keita. He's got options in the... Powering header! No, oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Morocco can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Hakimi, Hakimi plays it forward, tries to get it clear, promising move that, good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Keeper's ball. Forward it goes. Hakimi. Oh, they can break here. To Rapt. Oh, he's dealt with that well. He's tried one. Good first touch and almost as good a second. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Plays it out wide. Mane provides an outlet. Has a pop! It's in! And this is getting better and better. A pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. So that's two now without reply. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Zayek. And here's Tarat. A buccaneering run from the... He's gone for it! There's a goal! Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. That's just a great finish, but it's down to very clever movement. You can see this has been obviously worked on on the training ground. He knew exactly where he wanted the ball, and it all came good. Morocco get themselves back into contention. I think they can sense a comeback here, and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. Kuyate. Well, the scoreline is tight. The tie right on a knife edge. 
Tarapt did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Tries to get it forward quickly. Up towards the front line. And helps available out wide. out for a goal kick. Hakimi sends it forward. Idrissa Gay. Koulibaly. Kuyate. Nyang. Now it's Mane, he's got a work, and Mane! Oh, denied brilliantly! Mane really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Idrissa Gay with the short one. Ball's gone out of play. Buffal. Gets into a dangerous position. Oh, that had to be more accurate. And it's Niang. Buffal. Hoists it forward. That's not going to make it. Keita. Brought forward. What does he try from here? Has a hit! It's anyone's ball. Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. You lucky boy. You lucky, lucky boy. Giving the ball away like that is usually punished. Played it short. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Buffal. And it's played forward. Well, that's where he wants it. And it's Tarat. Kuyate, Koulibaly, Kuyate, Undiai, Koulibaly, Kuyate, gets wrestled off the ball, Buffal, Dira, Dira with a searching ball, Koulibaly knocks it away. Oh, he'd have done well to reach that. Idrissa Gay. He's got through. And he's there to hoof it away. It'll be a throw in. Mane. Keita. Morocco are still behind as we reach out for half time. Looks to thread it through. Played in with accuracy. Koulibaly does well there. Alert. Tries to get it forward quickly. Hit long and direct. It's a good looking cross. Tarapt drives it forward. More than happy to take the muscular approach. 
The defending, albeit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. And here's Keita, nicely controlled. And it's Kuyate. Idris again. Keita played into the middle. Hoists it forward. Good idea, just poorly executed. Idrissa Gay. Wage. And here's Mane. Wage plotting from out on the right-hand side. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. In he flies! Brave effort, total commitment. And no complaints about his effort and commitment. He just needs to start heading in the right direction. You get the drift. Al Ahmadi. Mane gets his foot in there. Mane with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. And that's going to be a booking. And out to safety. Ndi A real chance to break. Dinks one in. Kiyate. Keita. Idris again. Ndi shakes the shoot. Cleared without complication. And that's it for the first half. A breathless ending. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial so it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period well it remains very delicately poised and based on the the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two it certainly would be in keeping and the game has already resumed here I think they've got to go out at the start of this second half now and set a tone that smacks of intent and determination. Should they manage it, I think they can find a way back. And here's Keita. And it's Keita. A chance to play it in. Turns and goes back. And that's been lever clear. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. Gay out towards the flank. Wage. And here's Mane. Mane's cross. Defending of the desperate variety. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach, and it may just freshen things up. Well positioned to make that interception.
And it's played forward. Yeah, that does look a foul. The referee's given a free kick. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. Clear away. Looking for a decent ball in. Oh, it's die-hard defence and the willingness to put his body on the line. Very impressive. Keita desperately wants to get on the end of this. Keita looking to get on the end of this. Keita. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. Forward it goes. Mane looking to run onto it. Cuts it out. Idrissa Gay. Morocco really looking to get back into this at the start of the second half. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. And now they can launch a counter. Wage plays it forward. Idrissa Gay tries to get it forward quickly. And the defence can get it clear. Idrissa Gay really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Just brushed off the ball there. Wage. And it's been taken straight back. And it's Kuyate. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Clears it out of harm's way. Morocco are definitely going about this the right way. Well, Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. Idrissa Gay. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Well, the omens aren't looking favourable for them because they're, they're chasing the ball too much. Hoists it forward. Ndiaye. Idrissa Gay hits that long. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Wage gets into the right position to intercept. Al Ahmadi goes looking. Yate. Koulibaly. Kuyate. Idrissa Gay. Mane. Wage is charging up on the overlap.
Sayek. Oh, this looks promising. Got to make this count. Kiate gets it back. Wage. Idrissa Gay. And it's Niang. Played out to the right. Now it's Mane. And that's a throw. -in. Beautifully done. Kuyate. Ndi. Shade too heavy. Keeper can pick that up. Big chance to get at them. And it's played forward. Idrissa Gay tries to clear. Forward it goes. Good defending there. They've slammed the door in the faces of the opposition. Wage. And it's played forward. That's put paid to a promising move. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Back to the keeper and try something new. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Hoists it forward. And it's Zayek. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Dira. Zayek. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Ndi. That's been drilled forward. It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. Koulibaly. Tries to get it forward quickly. Wage. Yang. Mane is on to it and can take it up. Can he deliver? Chooses to go back. Ndi. He's gone for goal. And that would have won it. Badu Ndai has reacted in utter shock here. For him, the keeper has pulled off the impossible. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who is going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Done very well to intervene. And it's Mane. He's left his man. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Delivers a cross. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed. But will they? Well, it is a narrow lead, but they are clinging on to it right now. Now just moments away from a semi-final place. Morocco must do something here and very quickly. They need something heroic now or a lucky break or a kind refereeing decision. Anything. Defending of the desperate variety. Senegal are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end too. Ndi. Idrissa Gay. Just five minutes remaining now. Questions were asked, and he's given the answers. 
Dira. Dira drives it forward. Oh, good interception. Koulibaly. Idrissa Gay. Niang. Niang gets it out to the wing. Mane. Oh, nice touch. There are a few waiting for it. Ndiaye. Senegal can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. Zayek. Ndiaye. He's done ever so well. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Tarapt gets into a dangerous position. Koulibaly. That's it. They are out. Morocco all short of the semi finals. They all promised more, but ends on the brink of the last four. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Listen, losing is never a nice experience, especially in knockout football. And it's all about learning from your mistakes and, and growing as a team. So this can act as a good learning curve for them. In defeat, there are still positives to take from this.